Hey guys, it's Jeremy. Um, I was digging through my drawer and I found my original um, Nexus 7 tablet. If you have one and it's anything like mine, once it loses its charge, it can be such a pain in the butt to get it charging and back up again. Um, it, I know, especially if you lost the original charger, it can kind of be hit or miss what works with it. So what I found out that works good, um, first just connect it to your computer or the wall, it really doesn't matter, and just let it charge for a good few hours. You may not even see the screen light up, um, and you may even see the screen flicker, but just leave it how it is. And after it's been doing that for a while, so we're going to unplug it and plug it back in. Okay, so this is actually progress for me because I haven't even seen that. So it says it's charging. And I really don't want to touch it, like any buttons to turn it on for a while because I'm lucky enough for that to happen. Um, but let's just see for the sake of it. Let's try to turn it on when it's plugged in. Okay, I've tried turning it on and off, and it's not really getting anywhere, so at this point, I'm just going to let it do its thing for a little bit longer, and I will come back to you. Okay, a few minutes have passed. Um, let's see if it will turn on now. Charging icon comes up. <gasps> Look, there you go. Computer registered. Okay, it. so it says charging three percent. So it's like this battery was so drained, and I think the device was just having a hard time even registering that anything was plugged in. It's some huge flaw with the original Nexus 12. Um, so my only advice to you is to never let the battery die. Always have it in airplane mode when you're not using Wi-Fi because it's a freaking pain to get it back working again. Once this thing's charged up, I know for sure I'm never going to take it off the charger again.